Chloe, say hello to my little friend. Say goodnight to the bad guy. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step-troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan Prescott III. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa. Listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This'll chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. You really wanna take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office morgue. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Max, then accuses. Frank knows things about Rachel, and he might talk if he's been paid, right? You are super, Max. And with the leftover dough, I'll take you on a road trip to Portland for the day. We'll stock up on tats, beer, weed, and donuts, and books from Powell's, and strip clubs. Kidding. But, you never know. I feel like shit for taking that money. Max, then... Really want to take money from the hand?
That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish Splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Boys or girls? Girls, of course. Girls? Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Boys or girls? Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Boys or girls? Girls, of course. Girl. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... Flippers in a swimming pool? Are they training Navy frogmen here? Those look like the most cozy, comfy towels in towel history. Want. A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? The wit, it burns. Where does that other sock go? Those are some musty-ass old shirts. Yuck. This isn't a desperate cry for attention or anything. Well, we care, dickhead. I hope so, friend. Sorry, Rachel. Ooh, pink goo. I see why everybody brings their own soap. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> you wish, Max. You just look like a snoop. to know Victoria loves something besides herself. Welcome to 1950. I bet you do.
I guess I should consider this evolution. Some poor hipster lost their vape. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? This must be for training kids. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. Sometimes. Boy's locker room is right. This one is almost empty. The guys must like their pink goo. Max Caulfield, moral avenger. Or self-righteous hypocrite. Bros will be bros. Just when I thought it was safe to go back in the water. I don't think anybody has ever drowned here. I hope. Yes, we get it. Otters. Don't even think I'm gonna make a move on you. Look at the baby Halloween pumpkin. Chloe just couldn't wait to splish splash in the pool. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. Coffee and swimming. Good combo. Time to do or dive, Max. Oh yeah, baby, it feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie. Okay, you asked for it. Cow 
Cowabunga! Why, look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like... This force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Not that time. But that's because you were there to kickstart my power. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since Without me, you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Warren is... nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jump. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hi! Hi. Okay, if I go back over there, the guard will definitely bust me. Okay, if I go back over there, the guard will definitely bust me. power or just look for a hiding spot or both where are they hello hey Hello? 